Oh, welcome back uh, my gardening friends. So I've had a little break away, just had a potter around the garden after breaking one of the long roots. Uh, one left, that's the second sowing of the long black beetroot from Medwins. So I have time to spare today. So let's take my time and chill out. But I've spent hours and hours getting all these out. So do you get the good ones out first or last? I've learnt my lesson on that one, so let's just uh, be very, very careful. So the main idea of growing the roots at that angle, just enough of an angle so that they don't slide out. And this pond has collected water, but we didn't get the long roots uh, to come out. But uh, I'm not sure whether you can see uh, that root there. That one just about come out the the guttering but if it does come out the guttering to get myself a five meter root then at least it'll sit in the water and draw the nutrients up from that but we haven't uh, I've, I've used shop bought compost sieved but I still think I need to sieve it with a fire guard so that I don't get too many lumps in it when I'm washing it's always it's just when you've got time you've got to have time but anyway let's get this one upturned and see how we get on. Fingers crossed on part eight. Well, I must say, I enjoyed getting that one out. <laughs> and I mean it this time. Let's have a look and see why. Now, if I'd have done this one first, I'd have been overconfident. So, as you can see, we've still got the soil there because we've had a very good tap root to follow was able to get it out quite easily all the way till we got to about here and then I started at the other end to see which tap root went where and uh, they didn't they just uh, the tap root got bigger and bigger as it got to the end so I'm, I'm guaranteeing it's over four meters I'm pleased with that and that'll uh, as long as I pick it up okay um, the disappointment of uh, damaging the other one will be long gone well I can rest easy now to know that uh, that's in there I've just removed a little bit of more soil from uh, this root but look at the difference in root because this was the second sowing to the first sowing so sowing them early doesn't help at all but there again we'll be able to check we'll be able to look back on these and in the future to see yeah what went right what went wrong but considering eight roots get away wasp eight roots i've broke one i think i've done very well have you, as you've probably seen they are very very delicate by the time you've watched this you will have seen me uh, my cabbages and uh, the the rhubarb uh, the Malvern show itself and I might try and get some footage of uh, the measurements as well but this should be the last video this was just to show how we got the roots out and uh, to this length just a bit of luck all the giants this year were from seeds that we bought bar from the Cornish giant that I had sent to me uh, by Graham happy gardening to you all until next time my friends to for now